hi everyone and welcome in this video we will see how we can log backnet device data into sqlite database so if you have any backnet device running on your network and if you want to log that device data into sqlite database then how you can do that using python language okay so basically we are going to create backnet to sql logger in python so we have a backnet device running on our network we will create our own python backnet client and then we are going to read the data of the from this backnet device okay and then after reading the data from this backnet device we are going to log that data into sqlite database okay so this is what we are going to create in this video so we will minimize this one and here is our python script to log backnet device data into sqlite database so let me first run the backnet simulator on my network i will provide the download link of this backnet simulator in the description of this video you can download this simulator from there okay now our main task is to log the backnet device data into sqlite database so you can see on my desktop i don't have any sqlite database available on my desktop okay so here we have imported the necessary functions and libraries to run this script okay then after we have created the database and the table okay if the backnet underscore log table is not exist in the database then it will create the table if it is exist then it will not create the table and the source where my database will be generated is on my desktop but as you can see on my desktop i don't have any database right now because i didn't run this cell okay so if i run this cell now it is running you can see here okay it got completed and you can see we have a backnet data.db okay so we have a database here which we have created from this line and if i open this database and you can see backnet underscore log table and you can see the column names here if you go to browse data and select backnet underscore log table then you can see the column name but this table is empty because we didn't log any data into this table okay mm, yeah after that i have one function to get the detail of my backnet device so let me run this function and this is the main function here i am connecting with my backnet device and then after i am reading the all points and one by one i am logging all those point data into this sqlite database so let me close this one okay now we will run this cell here and we will run our main function so as you can see my backnet uh, broadcasting is on 192.168.1.6 on port number 47808 okay see you can see here the device 35881.07 which is my room simulator device okay building point list so point list is done and it is ready and you can see it is continuously running means the while loop is running continuously and it is logging the data on my database so if i refresh here then you can see 42 rows okay so we have a lot more data in our database okay so if i uh sorry so if i copy this temperature dot indoor tag and if i paste it here then you can see the value is continuously changing if i refresh it here then also you can see uh, new values uh, just a moment let me sort it Mm, yeah 35 okay you can see the value is currently 21.0 and if i change the mode from this software then this value will get changed very very soon okay you can see the value is drastically changing here it will log data every four seconds okay uh, i'm sorry here it is four seconds okay so if i refresh here then you can see value is changing here and it is logging at interval of four seconds so this is how you can log your backnet device data into sqlite database you, all you have to do is you have to use uh, this simple script to log your backnet device data into sqlite database this script is only used for one 
um, device okay if you have a multiple device in the network then you have to modify this script a lot more and also you have to add some you know exceptions uh, if device is not connected this is a very basic script to uh, read data from backnet device over the network and log data into the sqlite database okay if i change to vacancy then set point is 17 so this 18.6 will reduce to 17 so we have to wait more and you can see here it is uh, nearly 17.29 okay so this script will continuously read the data from backnet device over the network and it will try to log into the sqlite database you can also modify this script to log into other database like mssql or mysql or mongodb or anything else okay but the basic idea is you can log your backnet device data into any database using python script okay now if you want this script you can uh, go into the description I, I will provide the link for purchasing the script you can purchase the script from there okay so i hope everything is clear in this video and if you still have any doubt or any question regarding backnet to sql logging you can ping me on the whatsapp telegram instagram or you can also comment on this video the backnet simulator download link will be available available in the description of this video and the uh, code purchase link will also be available in the description of this video okay so we will meet you in the next video with a new update on backnet and python till then take care goodbye and thank you